How did four ordinary Joes become the elite super team known today as Penguins of Madagascar? Our story started out in the beginning. Oh. Live on the flippin' frozen tundra. It's the same old story. Confident, yet flightless natural born leader. Does anyone even know where we're marching to? Meets brilliant tactician. We appear to be flightless. Meets resourceful grunt. Oh, I like it. Meets, uh, private. Are you my family? You don't have a family and we're all going to die. What? What's the matter with you, Kowalski? From there, we took a job doing aerial security at Fort Knox. <laughs> Sir, we're approaching our target. Uh, it was on to danger in Venice. Skipper, here they come. And we are running out of canal. Go all terrain. <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> Success. Danger in Shanghai. All right, you, give us a good. So that's a baby squid. Sorry, laddie. Danger in New York City. We need a diversion. Private, you're up. You just mermaid my day. Basically, wherever danger dares to rear its ugly face, you will find <laughs> DreamWorks, Penguins of Madagascar. Yeah we'll take this to our graves. Agreed. In theater, November 26th. Hey, what's happening? Lisa here. Avengers fans assemble. Now, you all know that the film is the highest grossing comic book film of all time. But did you know, Thor is knocked off screen three times. Once by Iron Man and twice by Hulk. The code name for the film early in its production was <laughs> Group Hug. How sweet. To prepare for the role of Agent Clint Barton, Hawkeye, Jeremy Renner was trained by Olympic archers. Hmm, interesting. Now, that's all I've got for you today. I'm Lisa, and remember, Nine tailors make a man. See ya.